Hello and welcome to Lucy Vibes. Good to see you. Karibuni sana. Hey, when we thought we have seen it all. We thought we have seen it all. We have had it all. Now pastors at least sasa everything is just clean. Pastor Stano Akatwambia not yet. So today comes this revelled who is uh, uh, of course the wife and pastor. Buana ni pastor. So they are pastors all of them as if they are men and women of God. So they've stayed in a marriage in, in marriage for 40 good years. Number one, before I even continue, we have to agree that to on a single, single ladies outside there, single men outside there, to on a homes, to on a, you know, to kuna kuanga pia na homes, na kuko na watoto, na wale watoto wako na wazazi wow. Okay, kuko na watoto pia, of course they've never met their fathers, they have never met their biological father, but the fathers are roaming somewhere. Maybe aneza kuwe ni uyo brother yako, aneza kuwe ni yule yanko yako, aneza kuwe ni mtoto wako, aneza kuwe ni wababa yako. I'm telling you, that's why I always tell you, usikuja na makasiriko hapa, usikuja na makasiriko just because mtu moja memes, you know, utuna wewe. So anyway, let's just go straight to the point. So, Reverend amekuja pale kwa pasta, pasta show, haya wakafaniwa sanitization. Oh, akasema sisi tuko sawa lakini kitu ndakataza kijana wewe wewe kitu nakukataza ni hii simu simu tafadhali siwe, simu tafadhali ya mchugaji si kitu ya kushika shika hovyo ile mafuta iko na upako simu iko na tukambi sana hii simu iko na upako aya mama kapeana simu yake mzee akapeana akasema kwanza waombe huyu kijana wakaombea <laughs> Pastor uh, show the star nook, the guy aka wakamwambia wakamwambia hapa iko upako so haya simu ndiyo hiyo na kweli tukamwambia hapo maneno inatokanga so reverend ako tu pale mzee anaonekana kwa na bahasha yake hapa na tukasema hii hii inaweza kuwa ni nini inaweza kuwa ni kafuroti iko ndani kwa hii bahasha pesho wase ukishawaona na makaratasi zao na the briefcase sasa ni mataiko ndindi na mavitu za <laughs> So, anyway, so, kwa simu ya mama, mama was okay, mama the reverend was okay, yeah, yeah. kwa hasa alikuwa mesevu muze wake, my heaven on earth, alikuwa mesevu muze wake, my heaven on earth, we, tukasema mami, good job, aya, so, simu yake hiku kuwa na maneno, tukafika pare kwa reverend, kwa, 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 pasta, pasta, now, baby ndiyo reverend, muze, ni pasta, but let's just call up them pasta, as you understand, aya, so simu ya muzee ilikuwa na hii message. Haya ilikuwa did you meet uh, did you meet Anthony? Sasa ni message imetoka. Ilikuwa nani amemwandikia Reverend Jerry? Amemwandikia. Pastor akamjibu akamwambia nilimchukua tukaenda na yeye Kiambu. Jerry akamwambia Reverend. Aka, Reverend Jerry akamwambia aliniambia hiyo plot it's one of his best yenye umemwandikisha. Iko karibu na Rami one Rami Lami one kilometer to one, one kilometer to the town or something like that. Thank you for being a good dad to that boy. Muzea ka aza kukani kama na sweat. Tukama ambia shikiri ya pole pole. Don't sweat too much. Hapa sasa, hila unasema baba teremoka. Upaka wako baba tunawita. Kwa sababu sheta. Kalusi ngoja kidogo. So, tuendele. <laughs> so message zikaendelea. So aka so hapo kuna kama walikuwa wamebishana January hapo ndio sasa aka akamwambia kutakuwa na kutakuwa watakutana. Wata Wakasema hata wanakutana m mm, Ah, ane, kuna mahali Reverend alikuwa amemwambia bado uh, mtoto alifikisha 18 years um, na ulikuwa umempromise ulikuwa umempromise utampatia kwa sababu huyu mtoto hata toka na nguo na school fees na rent peke yake akamwambia si ulini promise ulini promise ile plot ya Kiambu na mzee akamwambia ndio na tutaenda kuandikisha lakini ni kama ilikuwa na mistake tafadhali mama reverend akamwambia lakini unasema aje how did you promise na next uh, na next of kin ni your wife akamwambia sasa huyu pastor akamwambia reverend sasa wanaongea huyu reverend bibi yake naye ameshtuka kwa tu ile ya he hii ni, ni nini mimi ninasikia ni huyu ni yule mzee wako ama kweli hadi shetani ni wewe huyu ni pastor si shetani so mam reverend injeri alikuwa amemwambia tafadhali vile ulikuwa umesema umenini ume hata hii plot imeandikwa nani imeandikwa mzee akamwambia tafadhali tukutane pale blue springs kabla watu wajaanza wa ma meeting ndio tuongee maneno na tafadhali nilikwambia hii maneno it is between me and you Till death do us part. Apo kulikuwa na mistake tukutane pare ndiyo tuonge hiyo maneno. Na haka mwabi I love you and I love my son Anthony. 
Sasa hao utasema ni watu wajuani. Si hao wanajuana. So mama kwa tu pale hata amini. Aya ndio pastor Stanley akamuuliza, "Do you know? Do unajua huyu Anthony? Anthony now it's this the boy now." Aya, uh, baboy akapatikana pia alikuwa ameandikia zina alikuwa ameandikia the father akalikuwa amemwambia, "Hello dad, where will you be today?" Nataka tuongelee ile kitu. Pastor akamwambia, Hello son, uh, nitakuwa church, nitakuwa church today. Um, feel free, uh, my son, you are my first priority. Sasa stanua kauliza uh, pastor, wewe unaweza kuwa unajua nani? Unajua huyu? Unaweza kuwa wewe unamujua? Unajua huyu Anthony? Akasema sasa manana ya simu si nilikukata si niliku. Bibi yako tu pale. Yaani mami amestuka. Our mami, our mami, our reverend mami is just amini. Amuze anasema, "Eh, hey, wachana, unajua hiyo simu? Ah, hizo message hazikukua hivyo. Oh, haikukua hivyo." To cut the story short. To cut the story short. Ni kumaanisha. So mama kakasirika akamwambia, "Ni wacha hata niende. Tumekuwa na wewe for so long." Muze akamwambia, "Hapana." And I was like, you see, Reverend Atangalia, Reverend Jerry will check Atangalia. Ata mama alisema, this is the, the pastor now. Alisema kwanza, Reverend, na kuwaga na mutoto wake na nishigo woman. Tuka mwambi, exactly. And that is why we always say, mukiona single women. Si kupenda kwa wakae bila nini, bila wababa, bila, of course, the fathers of their children. Maybe ni kuna mtu wali make the choice. Mamu kuna mungine, maybe wali kosana na mzee, ikakua wacha wakae peke yake. So, some, it is not their fault. So, Reverend Njeri, yeye sasa unaimagine wana kutananga pare kanisani na, na, na uyu mama, na uyu... <laughs> ana mobe hapa tunatukoza bwana muzee sasa na yeye ana, anawaangalia kwa ile yakayo kijua so these children belong to us and i always say and i think i've said in my past videos hata za kutoka my last year and before even we started doing this hizi za nini ya hizi za kusani as in wale watoto ni wetu ni part of us hata ukiwa kule kanisani usikuwa unachukia mtoto ama unasema yeye huyu pastor huyu singo huyu anakuanga you see these are grown ups they met together na waka ku do, did whatever they did they did whatever they did na mtoto akazaliwa na wezi sema mtoto wako na makosa so anyway pastor Everett akukwea ameambia mzee wa akua mzee akua ameambia bibi yake so it is now sasa bibi anamuuliza hii proti proti ya yani hii yangu ya kiambu ndio unaandikia huyu nani tukamwambia yeye hata huyu mtoto pia yako na right za kukua na kakitu <laughs> anasema iwezekani basta naye amesema huyo ni shetani it is not me shetani ndiye ameingililia kwa hizi simu na ukweli shetani ameingililia ameingililia kwa hizi masimo But I think it is the high time even us women sisi wanawake especially Kenyans Africans sana 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 Africans kwa sababu huku inchi za huku uwezi ficha watoto they are there whether you like it or not ukiingia ujue huyu mzee aliachana na bibi watoto wako and you guys will be taken care of them until we fikir 18 years that's how it is the same with us Kenyans it's only that we like pretending a lot na ndio nasemanga huyu Mungu tunasema huyu Mungu tunamuita kila wakati kila wakati you see now sasa zile bibi alikuwa anauliza pastor pastor maswali basi anaanza kusema wacha tuombe anaanza kumwambia tuna uh, utaenda na bibi yangu ataenda katika jina la ah see it's not about maombi kwa sababu watu wengi tunapenda kufunikia kufunikia tafadhali ni wacha tujue kuna kuanga na watoto wa single ladies this your husband could be the father of that child and there is nothing wrong because it happened and it happened it is you as a person to love those children the way you can you can love them at a distance mimi sina kitu ya kuongeza pale. Pasta, wacha tuendelee tu kutukuza neno la Bwana. Mama pa, mama pasta pia ye, sasa utabidi ukae na pasta Reverend Jerry. And in any case you don't have to sit together sababu mtoto ndiye anaongea pale. Mtoto apewe what what he has to be to be given by the dad. What else? Adawa isaza huu mzee ataumia. Alafu utakuwa unaona ukililia watoto wako atindio wao wapewe. Wale watoto wengine wako kule. Ukifikiria wale sasa si watoto. Ah ndo watakuja wapigane wa, 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 wa na huyu mwenye aliachiwa mali. Story inaishia hapo. Sasa hata tukiendelea kuomba, tatukiita jina ya Mungu. I think it is First of all ata us women sana sana sisi wanawake. Kwanza we kama uko hapo and you are a woman and you are listening to me. Siku ile mzee wako atakwambia ako na mtoto yeye what will be your next take Utaanza kuchukia yule mtoto 
Utaanza kusema oh ako katoto ka jangi ni stack iko kasikia so you see you are the problem you are the problem that's why muze wako pia atakuficha it is the high time we just be liberated uliza muze muze basta unaweza kuwa uko na watoto tukiomba tukue tunaombea what I'm, I'm telling you i might you know naweza kuwa ni kama nina check but that's how it is but anyway wacha tungoje tusikie maybe reverend at a letter even at all it is not this acting acting thing but even apart from acting eh we can all agree kuko na watoto wenye wako inje inje and they, they don't know their their biological father ama wanajua biological father lakini hawana ile contact kubwa ama as in kuko na single single women who have children do we know their father the father of these children so it could be my husband it could be your husband our sons <laughs> and that's it so it's a matter of now embracing yani tu yani dunia sasa tu embrace one another vile imesema we be neighbors keeper neighbors keeper you know hapo ndio sasa dunia inatufikisha hapo sisi wote hakuna wa mugongo wa mugongo unless wale a person will just sit down and trap mtu aseme sasa pale nina trap kupata mtoto wa yule ndio nipate sandaka hiyo nayo sasa tafadhali even if you bring this child utakuwa hata unajiletea shida because you just do some tricks and traps anyway that not be your portion i wish you all the best see you on my next one and i love you so much